Yoon Song successfully framed Hyun Woo and got him arrested by Interpol by accusing him of murdering Pyon Seong Uk. He also lied that he and Hae In loved each other, which is disgusting. Yoon Song imitated Hyun Woo by wrapping his hand in bandages, pretending to save Hae In from an accident by breaking window. When Yoon Woo returns to Korea, he will be interrogated by authorities and then imprisoned based on Yoon Song's deception. Yoon Song will trick Hae In and burn her entire notebook to erase traces of her past with Yoon Woo. He will also portray Yoon Woo as a bad person to turn Hae In against him. When Hae In arrived in Korea, she looked away from her mother. Hae In seems subconsciously curious about her ex-husband, so she decides to visit him in prison, and seeing him makes her heart hurts. Meanwhile, Yang E will uncover the real culprit behind Pyeong Song Yuk's murder by finding a crucial black box from the crime scene. Eventually, Yun Woo's innocence will be proven. Da Hai will meet Hyun Woo and give him the flash drive she stole from Jun Ho. Aside from data corruption, Yun Song will also be caught for investment fraud. In a dramatic Dramatic turn, Jun Ho will travel to Yongdori and kidnap Dahai. Su Chiol will attempt a rescue but end up injured in the process. Also, there is a plot hole in episode 14. No hospital would let Yun Song in Heian's room. Even when Yun Wu was dragged to jail, they would have just kept calling for her family or gotten in touch with him in jail to figure out who to talk to next. They are not just letting randoms walk up to ICUs. Yun Song must have paid so that he could be Heian's guardian, but there should be papers and Heian's consent.